Today we will see English Fairy Textbook Mathematics Education of Third Standard CBSC Syllabus. In this we will see first chapter Reggie's Mouse with Shrinking Clothes. Reggie's Mouse Shrinking Clothes. Warm up. Look at the food items in the picture carefully. Find their names in the word chain and circle them. One has been done for you. Let's complete this activity. Reading. Let us read the story of Reggie Mouse who only ate cheese and never played outside. Reggie Mouse loved cheese. He ate it for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Reggie's mother, Rita Mouse, was worried. Reggie. It's fine to eat cheese, but you should eat other foods like fruits, vegetables, cereals and fish. You should also play outside more often. Reggie didn't listen to her. No way mom, I love cheese. I won't eat anything else. It's too hot to play outside. Instead, I will watch TV. A few months later, Reggie Mouse was getting dressed when all, her, all the buttons of his shirt were Pop, pop, pop. Ricky was very much surprised. Oh no, my shirt has shrunk. And then his trousers went rip, rip, rip. Oh no, my trousers have shrunk too. Ricky's mouse ran to his cupboard and tried on all his clothes. Pop, pop, pop went all the buttons of his shirts. Rip, rip, rip went all his trousers. Oh no, all my clothes have shrunk. What's happening? Rita Mouse heard her son crying. She ran into his bedroom. Ricky, why are you crying and why are your clothes on the floor? Oh mom, it's awful. All my clothes have shrunk. I know what we can do to unshrink them. Reggie, you need to start eating healthy food like fruits, vegetables, cereals, fish and chicken. You also need to go out and play with your friends more often. That afternoon, Reggie played football with his friends. He had soup, carrots, spinach and grapes for dinner. And very soon, Reggie's clothes unshrank. Reading comprehension. Tick the correct answers to complete each sentence. Reggie's mouse loved eating cheese. Rita Mouse was Reggie's mother. When Reggie Mouse became father, father sorry, his clothes become, became too tight. To unshrink his clothes, Reggie's mouse started eating fruits and vegetables. He also started playing outdoor games. Answer the following questions. What advice did Reggie's mother give to her son? Why didn't Reggie listen to her advice? Why did the buttons of Reggie's shirt go pop? Why were Reggie's clothes lying on the floor? How did Reggie unshrink his clothes? Think and answer. Reggie started eating healthy and playing outdoor games every day. What do you think happened then? Discuss with your partner. Next values and life skills Along with eating healthy food and playing every day We need to maintain personal hygiene to remain healthy We should wash our hands with soap and water Before every meal and after visiting the toilet Then comes vocabulary Read these lines from the story All the buttons on his shirt went pop 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 Rip 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 went the trousers when the button breaks off, they pop. When the trousers tear, they make the sound rip. The words rip and pop are called some words. In pairs, pick out the correct words and fill in the blanks. Bees in the air go buzz. Shoes on the feet go swing. Snakes in the sun go hiss. Crackers go boom. Ducks in the pond go quank. Clothes in the mongo, tick tock. Cats in the alley go meow. Horns in the car go honk. 
can you add a few more sentences with sound words to this list look at the pictures complete the word words with the word that come in your mind you can complete this activity grammar common nouns are names of people animal place and thing for example mother tiger city and table are common nouns proper nouns are the names of a particular person place or thing for example rekha akram new delhi and taj mahal read this story with your elbow partner cross out all the common nouns and replace them with proper nouns two have been done for you write the sentences in the blank you can complete this activity Collective nouns are the words used for groups of people, animals, or things. For example, a bunch of geese, an army of soldiers, a class of students, a flock of sheep, a shoal of fish, a team of players. Unscramble the letters and write the collective nouns. A pride of lions, a gaggle of geese, a bunch of grapes, a colony of ants, a litter of puppies. a gang of thieves a crowd of people a pack of rats you and your friend are having a friendly competition on using collective nouns who is going to win add two more sentences with collective nouns to this dialogue okay listening listen to the passage and complete these sentences children are playing outdoor games give children happiness these activities help them to grow they also learn to solve problems children become confident after playing okay then speaking imagine that you have decided to set up a restaurant with your friends discuss what type of food will your restaurant serve what will you name the restaurant what's going to be menu you have your first customer at the restaurant do a role play this is a activity then pronunciation underline th in each of the word below notice how it's pronounced differently sometimes we use a soft sound and sometimes a hard sound color all the soft sounds blue and hard sounds brown you can complete this activity then writing reading sorry writing read the conversation between janani and her mother they are in a supermarket to buy their weekly grocery complete the conversation with the words given in the box this is a activity which you can complete now complete the paragraph on healthy habits based on the conversation you completed above use the given words in the box can complete then comes my word bank find all the names of food mentioned in this story write them here you can complete it yeah this completes the chapter thank you